So we have officially cleared Paper Mario Pro Mode, we've beaten the main story, however there's still some more content left in the game. There's some post-content that apparently has been added in. Uh, there's still some star pieces we have left to get, there's apparently one recipe we have left to get. Anyhow, let's dive on in! Thankfully we have the wart pipe that takes us back to the Northern Toad Town pipe. Which is excellent, otherwise if we if we had to backtrack through all of Bowser's Castle, I would have had to do that off stream, and well, it would have taken even longer to start this up. Because I had a late start, I will probably uh, stream later than I normally do to hopefully get in around an hour and a half. I highly doubt I'll be able to get through all of the post-game content in a single stream. If I think I can, though, I might make this just a longer than usual stream, because I don't have to start work tomorrow as early as I normally do. I guess technically I never have to. I just choose to work at 6.30 for reasons. <laughs> Alright, unfortunately we no longer get to hear the awesome Bowser music. It's okay. Alright, back to Toad Town. No sound? Can you not hear it? Can you not hear what's going on? I f it should have sound. You thought so too, but Twitch was messing up? Is there sound or isn't there? Also, hi Proxima, hi Nintendo Addict. Welcome to the stream. OBS says that I'm recording my voice and my sound, so I don't... I think that must be an issue on your end, Proxima. Alright, we are officially cleaned out of Rolf's badges. Hmm. That is strange. Alright, unfortunately we have to say goodbye to our pebble. Well, I guess it is we didn't have to, but... Oh, I should have cooked it into a mistake. That would have been funny. I'm pretty sure the one recipe we have left to make is the just the regular old cake, because I'm pretty sure I didn't make it myself. I had to let uh, Tasty make it for me to give it to Gourmet Guy, so I guess we're going to buy some cake mix. Whee! I guess one other thing we could do, I'm not going to do it on stream, but maybe I'll do it off stream, is we can level grind on Amazie Daisies. Here's the cake mix. <laughs> Bake me a cake. Woohoo! Alright. Our next step of the way is to finish all the Chuck Quizmo quizzes. We also have to do the Chapter 8 challenge from the Boo. I wonder if Koopa Koot has any more favors. Nope. He's still just saying, Our defeat Bowser. Okay, that's fine. It would have been interesting if they added more Koopa Koot favors. Alright. No Quizmo. Perhaps he's in the outpost. Hopefully we can get through all of the rest of his questions in a single go, but I'm pr almost certainly going to screw up multiple times, so bear with me, folks. <laughs> They're new questions. And worst case, I can always get Merly, or I'm sorry, Merlovely, to predict where the star pieces are. Because I'm actually missing a large quantity of star pieces. More than I think are in the normal game. So, there must... Maybe clearing some of the post-game content gives you extra star pieces. That's my only guess, really. Because I have no... I'm missing, like, 20 or something. And only, I think, four of them are going to come from Chuck Quizmo. And I'm pretty sure I've gotten all the rest of them, so... Mm. 
Don't know what to make about that. Alright, no Quizmo here either. Is he in... He's either in Shiver City, or I still can't reach him. Although, there's literally... If he's still not appearing, I don't know how to get him to appear, because I have literally gotten to the very end of the game, and you can't save after beating it, so... We'll just have to wait and see. You may need to check out the mysterious new building in Shooting Star Summit. If he's not in Shiver City, I will go and do that. I'm pretty sure I bought the star piece from Cheat Rippo. I really like the look of the frozen sewer. It's a shame that they, there isn't more of it. Okay, nope, he's not here. Alright, guess we're checking out the new place in Sh uh, Shooting Star Summit, then. I've, I've been there earlier, but there was nothing there, but I bet new stuff has opened up. I also need to check to make sure that the cake was indeed the last recipe I needed. Because if it wasn't, I actually don't know what it would be. I love the sound of that gate opening. It's a weird thing to like, but I do. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I am. Alright, let's check this place out. Hey, Twink! You are not... Oh, I see Miss Star up there, too. Hey, Mario, ready for a rematch against the Goomba King and his two lack... What? Oh, are you serious? We get to refight. Oh, we get to refight the bosses, don't we? Oh, that's so cool. You get to refight the Goomba King? That's awesome! Okay, well, we're gonna prep for this. No last stand for us. No feeling fine, no zap tap. We're going to use Mega Quake to hit all of them. Also get Power Bounce. Dodge Master, maybe? Actually, Power Bounce against bosses is not very effective, so that's actually probably a bad idea. Actually, I'll have Zap Tap on. That sounds fine. Let's try P up D down. Oh, man. They aren't the same either. They're much harder. I'm, I figured it's not going to be the same as the original Goomba King. Oh, man. This game... This room is lagging. <laughs> I hope he's tougher. This will be awesome. All right. All right. Show them who's boss. Oh my gosh. What? 100 HP, 55 HP, 45 HP. Well, it's a good thing we have Mega Quake. Alright, where well you gotta hit all of them. I mean, we don't have to, but we're going to. What? Why does that inflict me with a status effect? 
Wow, they hit like trucks. What? How does this make any sense? Uh, hi Mobius, welcome. We're gonna dizzy shell this guy. Well, we're gonna try to. Never mind. Thanks, Dizzy Shell. You're great as always. Okay, apparently, um, you get dazed because of the Goom Nut Tree. All right, well, um, we are, we are going to die. Oh, we are absolutely going to die unless we out of sight. <laughs> well, yeah, they are not screwing around this time. Goomba Cane with 100 HP. Okay! How about a kiss? This is crazy. I was not expecting this. Um... What? What is going on? Why is there a Voltrum stuck to my face? Did the Goomba King use a Voltrum but throw it at my... What? Is this a glitch? What is going on here? I am so confused. <laughs> no, that's that's a glitch. Okay. Uh, that's Cloud Nine. Why is the Voltrum still on screen? Oh, thank goodness. Stop boosting his defense, you dumb butt! Witchcraft. Literally. <laughs> do I get a Voltrum if I beat the guy? I don't really care if I do or not, but... Can Cooper... He can. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense that the Goomba King takes electrified damage from that. Some of the new custom attacks are buggy, uh, apparently. Well, hmm. Let's try to take out Red Goomba. There we go, and now I can get... Goombario or Bo to take out Blue Goomba. Slap. Oh, what do you mean he has defense? I don't like the look of that. Why is he throwing mushrooms at me? <laughs> Alright, get out of here, Blue Goomba. You figured he would have defense? I wasn't figuring that. Alright, well, because of all of the defense boosts this guy has now... Electro Dash! Why are those Goom Nuts respawning above me? Oh, I died. Because I couldn't action guard his kick attack. Because I'm not used to action guarding his kick attack. I didn't really want to use a Life Shroom against the Goomba Cane, but okay. Guess that happens. The effect of Cloud Nine has worn off. Oh no, that's not good. We better get a kiss. He is a mushroom creature, so he throws mushrooms at you. Well, are Goombas mushroom creatures? I always thought they were their own thing. I guess they do kind of look like mushrooms. That Voltrum is bugging out, and I don't like it. I got pedazed, and I don't like it. <laughs> and I have no FP and no way of replenishing it. This is not good. I do have another life shroom, but I don't want to use it. Just hold on there, Mario. Okay. Do I really have to eat something? I'll eat a yummy meal. I do have Deluxe Feasts for the later fights.
In your face. Oh, he has a lot of defense. That was stupid. Doggone it! Why is that so hard to action guard? I have a plan. Jeez, Goomba Kane is, um... I never thought he would be a difficult boss, but here we go. I do have another life stream. Those are easy to get. And he's the easiest of the refights. I kind of figured he would be. Oh, I shudder to think what Huff and Puff is going to be like. I'm excited for Lava Piranha, though. Alright, well, get out of here, Goomba King. Wow! We got some star points! We gotta get more HP, folks. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? I have to fight him again. I don't need any calming tea. Oh. <laughs> uh... At least I know what to expect now, so I'm going to be uh, changing my badge setup a little bit. I definitely still want... I think I still want Mega Quake. Maybe I don't. Zap Tap is not really such a much. I do kind of want Flower Saver. D-Down Jump could be nice, but I don't think I need it. Ooh, actually, feeling fine with... Okay. I'm unequipping that. I don't need want P up D down, because survival is actually important. I will be getting feeling fine, because boy howdy, am I sick of getting paralyzed. I don't like all the lag in this room. <laughs> Alright, let's try to beat Goomba King without needing to utilize both of our life shrooms. So help me, if it crashes again after beating him, I'm going to be unhappy. <laughs> oh wait, I should hit the Goom Nut Tree whenever I can. Oh, now I action guard it. Save with a save state as soon as the boss battle ends. Here's the problem. The emulator I'm using doesn't handle save states very well. I've had it crash just for saving a state. No joke. So, no, there's not a whole lot I can do about that. I can try it. Okay, I think Zap Tap plus his item throw move. Kind of screw things up. Oh, never mind. Why is he dealing so much less damage this time? It's probably just purely because I'm not getting paralyzed. Oh my gosh, this guy's easy. Yeah, without Zap Tap, those aren't glitching. I wonder if it was the item sticking to the screen that was causing the emulator to crash. Or no, that's the game crashing, not the emulator crashing. Alright, goodbye, Blue Goomba. Red Goomba is ripe for the pickings as well. Oh yeah, this is way easier. 
just gotta know what to expect. Wow, this is so much easier. What the heck? Yeah, hopefully it's not crashing trying to reload the NPC room. I really hope so. Now I'm getting the action guard down. Wow. This fight is a little bit of a joke. <laughs> now it is. Alright, goodbye, Goomba King. Wow, you were way easier the second time. <laughs> I guess this is the third time, actually. First time was his real fight. Alright, let's try that again. I'll wait for my FP to completely refill. Crash? Crash. Well, this is... Uh, Mamma mia, this is getting a little out of hand. <laughs> um, boy. Hmm. This is... This is quite the precarious situation. Hmm. Yeah, it keeps crashing every time it reloads. That's not good. Do I have any other N64 emulators I can try this on? Jeez, that literally jump scares me every time. Uh... Do I have Project 64? I don't think I do anymore. No. I un I got rid of all my other emulators because I'm like, <laughs> I don't need any. I have Bizhawk. Because I thought Bizhawk was the ultimate. Well, crud. You know what we're going to do, folks? We're still going to try to beat all these guys. Maybe we won't get a reward for beating all of them because it won't save that we beat them all. But we're still going to try them all out. Project 64 is the best. Um, disagree. But hey, Project 64 probably wouldn't ha be having these problems. So next up, I guess we'll fight the Koopa Bros. And I probably am not going to change my badge setup at all. No, I'm actually happy with this badge setup. We're going to try Koopa Bros. Well met, Mario. The Koopa Bros are prepared for a rematch, are you? Yep. Give them no quarter. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I'm excited. They only have 70 HP apiece? And they don't even start stacked on each other. Wow. Oh my gosh, I'm ex I'm so excited to fight the Koopa Bros again. I kind of wanted to fight the Koopa Bros in Bowser's Castle. I was hoping they would change that. Well, this is why we have Mecha Quake, folks. I think I'm going to conserve and not use Fire Shell. Yeah, I figured they were going to attack immediately after getting back up. Yo, you're going to electrify him. Whatever will I do? He got an electric charge. They're not... These guys are easier than before. Okay, you're giving him stat boosts. All right, that's that's interesting. But these guys seem like they're easier than before. They're not stacking on top of each other and doing stupidly high damage. I love how when the black one is electrified upside down, he, he looks like he's dead. Well, this seems like it'll be relatively easy. Where, where did the green one go? Um, that's not what I was expecting would happen. Okay, well, if I can't hit all of them, I'm not going to. Uh, yeah. They are pulling a Dragoon from Final Fantasy. Wow, I missed the action command. Oh, there he is! And he electrified himself. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. They have new moves. Okay, if, the, if just one of them is gone, I'll happily Mega Quake them all. This is so awesome. I love this! <laughs> This is the best hack I've ever played! <laughs> Excluding randomizers.
They're still not doing very much damage, granted. Oh, why? Nope, I'm not letting you be transparent. That's just not happening. Yeah, each color can... Oh, each color Koopa has their own status buff. So yellow can electrify, red can attack boost, black can make people transparent. Ooh, that's not good. All right, well, we're going Cloud Nine. <laughs> and he landed on his butt. Oh, you are the... Oh, he's the worst. <laughs> they keep landing on their butts, and it's funny. If they, if they jump off screen, it gets rid of their status buff, it looks like. That's that's interesting. Okay, Yellows is kind of annoying without Zap Tap, so let's take him out too. Wait, no, I think Sushi Squirt just won't do. It. Well, we'll try it. Dog on it. Yeah, it leaves him with one health. Oh no, it doesn't get rid of their status buffs being off screen. It looked like it did. This is a cool fight. I really like this. <laughs> this is like the epitome of a great bonus boss. I mean, I've always loved the Koopa Bros. They've, they've always been some of my favorite bosses ever. And this just puts them over the. <laughs> pushes them over the edge. <laughs> All right. Cloud Nine is one off. Wow, his transparency didn't though. I see how it is. Star beam him. This is so cool though. I'm really annoyed that I can't save that I beat these guys though. <laughs> but you know what? I can always beat them off again off screen on a different emulator, which I will try to do. Stop making people transparent, you crud butt. Well, gee, I wonder what I'm gonna do. I love you, Starbeam. Man, I'm so glad I learned Starbeam just gets rid of all status enhancements and not just Bowser's. <laughs> Yes, please do that attack. This is also not a terribly tough fight. Granted, I have all of the damage dodges, but still. Alright. We're getting rid of black. <laughs> as soon as possible. Just red should not be an issue. Part of me is wondering if me leveling up after these is also having an effect on whether it crashes or not, or if it's literally just my laptop mixed with the emulator I'm using, mixed with all of the sprites and how big this room is. I don't think... Did we ever get to see Green's status enhancement that he can give others? I don't think we did. I'm assuming it's defense up. Yeah, you're by yourself, Red. You're not gonna win. The level up routine might be messing with the reload. I'll, I'll see if I can level up and then try it. I mean, he's about to die, so... 
So long, the Koopa! Wah! <laughs> oh, I love that fight. Yeah, I only have to get six points to level. I'll just grind an amazing daisy. What? It didn't it didn't crash that time! Excellent work. These two star pieces are all I can give you for your effort. Ah, this is where the extra star pieces are. Okay, it didn't crash that time. Only Goomba Keen crashes it. Okay. Hmm. Well. Ain't that a coinky dink Alright, we're gonna try Tut and Koopa next. Oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. I should have saved before I open this up. I want to do my badge setup first, though. All right. Mega Quake? I think Mega... I can't remember if Quake Hammer actually affects Tut and Koopa or not. I'm going to keep that just in case, because Chomp will probably be annoying in this fight. Flower Saber, yeah, this all looks pretty good. Actually, yeah. Mm, D-down jump, though. D I'm going to see if D-down jump will work better. Submit! I'm going to see if D-Down Jump works better than that. Ooh, maybe I could shrink Chomp. That could actually be fun. I'll also equip Quake Hammer just to see if, if I fail. If Quake Hammer actually works. That's what I'm going to do. Oh, there's a second floor? Oh my gosh, I forgot how big this place is. It's enormous. It's huge. Alright, hi, Mamar. Good to see you. Would you like to try a rematch against King Tut and Koopa? Yes, please. Hey, Janae, welcome. Is this a boss rush? So, apparently in Paper Mario Pro Mode, you can refight all of the bosses again, but they're way tougher. And also have, like, a 90% chance of crashing the game after you beat them. Or maybe that's just my emulator. No, you can do it, Mario. Oh, Tut and Koopa! What? <laughs> you could not have timed that better. <laughs> that was literally flawlessly timed. Okay. Quake Hammer does affect Tut and Koopa. All right, that's good to know. I'm going to jump on him just to see if he has defense. I think he had defense in the regular game, yeah. Yeah, it looks like we got to take him out real fast. We have 13 turns to kill him. No. Oh, you butt. He's not even summoning Chomp. Okay, well, we, we can't let this stand. We have to star beam him immediately. Oh, if we have to beat him fast... Then we... I don't think we can even use Watt. I think we have to use just our strongest attacks, so... Blech! That only deals one extra... Is he just gonna do this every turn? He better not. After 13 turns, you can start dropping to 0 HP when your turn starts. Oh, wow. Oh, life streams can buy you one turn each. Well, it's a good thing to have two of them, then. Okay, if, if he's just going to use transparency every turn, I actually need to, um... I need a different strategy, don't I? Uh, let's see. Cooper and Bombat can't even hurt him. Goombario could charge and multibonk. That could be a decent idea. Watt just deals decent damage every turn. <sighs> okay, does this actually deal more damage than Squirt does? No, it's the same damage, and it takes more FP. <laughs> come, Chomp, come! Bite this intruder! Okay, he's not making himself transparent. That's good. Thank goodness for small favors. Ten turns remain. Alright. We're ignoring Chomp. Yeah, we're just sticking with sushi. Man, I un I forgot how good Squirt is. Squirt is way better. It's like Shell Shot, but better. <laughs> yeah, we can totally ignore Chomp. 
Why? Wow, that deals a lot of damage. Oh, you're throwing multiple shells. Ow, that, okay, that does deal a lot of damage. And Chomp gets more powerful every turn. Fun. At least he's not making himself transparent every turn, though. Also, who would have thought the monkey drum could sound so ominous in a boss fight? Ouch! Oh, I'm not... Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is very bad! That is awful, actually. My party member is now dead. Chomp ramps up if ignored. Interesting dynamic. I like that. I will be equipping Mega Quake for the inevitable rematch I have to do against him. Whether if I lose or because uh, the emulator will probably crash. Ow, oh, wow. That, sec that second one, man. That's a doozy to action guard. Seven turns remain. Um... I kind of need to buff my HP, and he is reasonably close to death, so we'll we'll use an item. It's annoying that my party member is knocked out. And somehow, I don't think Tonkoop is going to knock himself out with his magic in the refight. Okay, so at this point, my party member is just out of commission. What emulator am I using? I'm using Bizhawk. Yeah, okay, so I just have no party member now. Alright, fun. Bizhawk is really good. It can emulate basically anything. But also, it can't really save state or do stuff like that. Or I, it's supposed to, I can't. If I use Starbeam here, will this also take away Chomp's health, uh, strength bonus? I would think it would, because that is a status enhancement. Yes, it does! <laughs> Excellent. Alright. Alright, Artie, just action guard this. There we go! Four turns remain. Okay, we gotta... Hmm... I'm assuming bosses are just completely immune to status effects, because why would we make status effects good? Well, there goes our life shroom! That's annoying how your party member is just out for the fight. Unless you can predict when he's going to do this and out of sight at that point, but... Ouch. Also, can you action guard that? It doesn't look like you can. If I can survive this next attack, then I can defeat him with a D-down jump. Unless I have to defeat Chomp, too. No, you shouldn't. You shouldn't. In the vanilla game, when you defeat Tung Koopa, Chomp immediately dies, too. That's why in a vanilla game, I always just ignore Chomp. Alright, bye, Tutton Koopa. And there they go. Bye! That was really cool. I like that fight a lot. I love these refights a lot, actually. Is it going to crash? It's not going to crash! Only Goomba King crashes, apparently. Wonderful. Please take my last two star pieces as a reward. Here's these directions. Sweet. That is very nice. And I didn't use any star spirits. All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Tubba Blubba next. I think D-Down Jump is a good idea. I think he's going to have defense. Quake Hammer, we don't need. I don't think we need Flower Saver either. We do have Fuel and Fine. That's good. Zap Tap actually might come in handy, because he does do physical attacks against us. And... I have a feeling he's going to put us in danger, so let's do Power Rush as well. Oh my gosh. I wonder if it's just because Goomba King is oh, positioned... I, believe you. <laughs> I wonder if Goomba King is ju it's just because he's positioned in a center where you can see everything, if that's why it crashes, or... There's just <laughs> magic dust that happens. 
Good day, Mario. Are you ready for another round with the invincible Tubba Blubba? I wonder if this will be his heart and just him, or if it'll be only one of them. This should be interesting. Best of luck and keep your wits about you. Best boss music in the game. Okay, it's just his... It's just his reformed, like his reunited uh, form, and he only has 80 HP. How powerful is this guy going to be? How much damage is he going to do? Or is he going to, like, drain my HP? Because there's no way it's going to be this simple. Okay, there we go. Uh, so he dealt, he dealt no... I see. I see! That's it. He heals every turn and gets stronger every turn. Alrighty! And it's a good thing I feel and fine equipped. Okay, well... If Squirt does more damage, I'm doing Squirt every turn. Squirt does quite a bit more damage every turn. Actually, he has no defense, does he? Well, that doesn't look good. Did he get super powerful because he's at half health or less? Oh, dear. Um... So, does D-Down Jump even do more damage? It does one more damage. Okay. Use Squirt every turn. Squirt that guy every turn. I... Oh! Submit! Oh! 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 I see that. That's so cool. He brings back the hearts move. Also, I've only actually seen that heart move attack successfully attack once in my life before now. Okay. Oh my gosh. That action guard saved my life. And I have power rush. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, that was so good. I like how they brought back his heart charge move. That was so interesting. <laughs> Clutch. So much for the invincible Tubba Blubba, eh? Here, take these star pieces. Use them as you see fit. Well, there's only one thing in the game you can use these for. But thank you, Scholar. Oh, General Guy. I'm actually worried about General Guy. General Guy's the boss who uh, killed me the most in the vanilla version... Or, not vanilla game. In just the main campaign. <laughs> you can tell how much the game is lagging based on how slowly my HP is refilling. Alright, definitely D-Down Jump. That's a must. That's gonna be what I use against him every turn. If he has other Shy Guys to help him, I'm also going to want pow uh, Mega Quake. Because I know he constantly summoned enemies in the generic version of the fight, so I think he's going to do that again this time. Uh, definitely keeping Feeling Fine on. For sure, Feeling Fine is a must for all of these fights, because it looks like they can all inflict some kind of nasty status effect against us. Um... Dodge Master, maybe? Nah. Let's try P up D down. I'm feeling risky. Alright, I think we're just gonna fight his tank form, but we might have to fight the Shy Squad, Stilt Guys, and Shy Stacks. I don't think so, but maybe. I heard General Guy and his troops are looking for another fight. What do you say? Yep. That's what I like to hear! Send them back to whatever toy box they crawled out of! Uh, 
Okay, it's okay. It's just his tank form. Okay, so and he does summon these guys. Oh, he does some. He summons kind of a lot of these guys. I probably should have equipped a flower saver badge of some kind. <laughs> that hurt. Where'd you learn to fight? You must be cheating. No, I just have Mega Quake, which is kind of cheating, actually. Well, we might not need D-Down Jump. Grrr! My high-tech tank defenses don't seem to stand up to that electric attack! Quit doing that! It's it's too powerful! You're breaking the rules of war! That was strange. Okay. Oh, Spy Guy. Yuck. If it was just a Pyro Guy, I'd probably let him live. And my party members are... No, I, my party members are strong enough to take him down. Well, <laughs> one of them is. <laughs> hey, Sushi, gotta squirt this guy. Oh my gosh, Sushi Squirt! Why did I forget how good this move is? It's really good! Plus two attack? Oh, but he can still die in one hit. Oh no. Oh no! Sushi, no! <laughs> okay, note to self, always have Sushi attack first. And then swap to Watt with Quick Change. Oh, this doesn't seem like it'll be too bad. Oh man, why Why did I neglect D-Down Jump in all of my vanilla playthroughs? Like, it's really good! Haha, <laughs> there we go. Like, whenever I played this as a kid, I never used D-Down Jump, and I don't know why. It's amazing. Yeah, now we swap to Watt, so if he uses Electric Attack, no biggie. Oh no, Pyro Guy. Oh no, Spy Guy. Oh no, Pyro Guy gets plus two attack power. Oh no, he threw a bomb. He literally took, like, four attacks in one turn. He's been drinking Hustle Drinks. D down jump is busted. <laughs> yeah, forget power bounce. Who needs power bounce? Especially in this mod where enemies have more defense. Yeah, it's really good in this mod. I guess that's part of it. Vanilla game doesn't have a lot of enemies that have high defense. Oh, guys, we win. <laughs> wow, that was very easy. Granted, I knew what to expect. Oh, wait! The light bulb can break! Or maybe that's just part of defeating him and it shatters. But it actually had HP. Woohoo! Oh, wow. We're only two level ups away from... I'm gonna max out my HP. We're two level ups away from capping stats. Ooh, those guys got crushed! Here, I got two star pieces for you. Use them well. Ah, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna save Lava Piranha for last. I'm so freaking pumped to fight Lava Piranha. I'm going to save him for last. We're going to do Huff and Puff next. Oh, boy. This is the one I'm most dreading. D-Down Jump, no. Mega Quake, no. Quick Change, absolutely yes. Oh, I also had P up, D-Down. I think I would, I'd rather have P down, D up for this fight for those stupid Tough Puffs. Maybe Last Stand as well, honestly. I definitely want Zap Tap so I can jump on him while he's electrified. Yeah, I think that's all we really need for this fight. And we gonna want lack of Lester. Because Spiny Surge is actually quite useful for- Actually, no, it's not. His Tough Puffs has too much HP for Spiny Surge to be useful. Oh, well, we're still bringing him along for the ride. Hello again, Mario. Do you want another fight with Master Huffinpuff? Yes. Be careful. You barely beat him the first time. Hey! That's a low blow! I wiped the floor with him the first time. 120 health. My man. I... Actually, spiny... Sur I mean, half of them are trans... Actually, more than half of them are transparent. Forget this.
I should have done that in the opposite order, but oh well. Master Huff and Puff, I wish to pummel Mario too! Permission to attack? Yes, take him! I'm worried, because Huff and Puff gets monstrously powerful when he's low on HP. Oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, P down D up. That's why I equipped P down D up. So that they're not going to be problematic at all. Oh, that only deals 8 damage? That's not even as good as I thought it was. I thought adult 10. <laughs> Defend plus and, D and P down D up. Make it so that his rough puffs cannot hurt us. Alright, this is bad. Alright, whew! That actually didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. I think Spiny Surge actually will kill them now, because uh, Lackalester is at Ultra rank. I think, I hope, yes! Nice job, Lackalester. Now he won't refill nearly as much HP. Yeah, I'm afraid that if Huff and Puff gets, like, at around 50 HP or less, he's just going to do his, like, 18 damage dealing attack every turn, which is, like, impossible to action guard. I'm not looking forward to that, personally. I have gotten it so that his wind attack doesn't do any damage with a combination of last stand and uh, chill out. In my level zero run, you asked for it. Now you'll witness the full power of my storm! Master Hufflepuff, leave him to me! You can't do any damage, you idiots! <laughs> the attack it usually isn't guarded because you're mash. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, this is why I equipped Zap Tap. Not to damage the guys, because they're immune to electricity. I did it so I can do this! Jump on his head. Oh man, if there's any fight where Quick Change really shines, it's the Huff and Puff fight. I mean, it really shines in basically every battle, but this one especially. They're like, huh? We, did, we weren't able to hurt him? Blam. Star Storm. You've all been very bad, bad boys. Also, you all have 4 HP, so heh <laughs> just enough to kill. Normally, offense reigns supreme, but for Huff and Puff, defense actually reigns supreme. <laughs> Did you just feel a breeze? I thought I felt a breeze! Speaking of breeze, this fight seems like it's a breeze. Uh-oh. Time to mash! I am very bad at mashing, but... Whew. I've only taken four damage this entire fight. It's ridiculous. I don't think he's going to inhale his guys. I think he's going to charge up for his next electric attack. That's how his AI usually goes. Wow, what a joke! Yep, that's what I thought he was going to do. Oh no! I suck! Out of sight. Vegemite, Larry boy. Yeah, he doesn't have any new gimmicks. I thought it. I thought just by nature of having way more HP, I thought also his tough buffs are gonna get buffed, so they would deal more HP, which is why I equipped the P down D up badge. 
I did not expect it to literally just do nothing. However, I think at this point he has such low HP he's going to do his super powerful attacks now. The fact that I'm able to negate all damage from his tough buffs is ridiculous. Okay, well he's getting a lot of HP back. Oh, only 15? I thought he was getting more than that. Bow's smack is pretty useful against him, because it'll generate a bunch of weak tough puffs. So even if he inhales them back, he doesn't get much HP. <laughs> when you haven't watched this uh, since Artie was in World 1 because your computer's dumb, you must make up for the tragedy. Hey, Marty! How's it going? Um, so... <laughs> Marty, this is not... Huff and Puff, this is bonus Huff and Puff. We're fighting all of the bosses in the game a second time, and they're all a lot tougher, but Huff and Puff is actually easier this time than he was in the past. <laughs> Mainly because we're just monstrously more powerful. Guys, um, I think Huff and Puff is going to get down to literally 1 HP. Oh man. I could have survived that, yeah. We're going to deal 10 damage. He's going to be down to 1 HP. <laughs> and Bo can't even attack! <laughs> because she out of sighted. Well, if he's smart, he will, uh... We seem to be in trouble! Mm, I guess I'd better stop messing around and fight hard! <laughs> That's Huff and Puff! Will you be alright, Master? We're not finished yet! Here I come! Submit! <laughs> this is the attack I thought he was gonna spam way more. Yeah! I thought he was gonna use that attack a whole lot more. Guys, goodbye, Huff and Puff. <laughs> no! <laughs> Nice job, Bo. There really is no stopping you. I've got two star pieces with your name on them. Not literally, of course. Star piece! Star piece! Aw, oh, yeah. Alright. We got Crystal King, we got Lava Piranha, we have to find the... <laughs> I think Bowser's at the end, and then we also have the ultimate challenge, beating Goomba King without crashing the game. Alright, Crystal Keen, Crystal Keen. No zap tap. Definitely yes to feeling fine. Just in case I can't guard his frostbite move. We definitely want uh, D down jump. And what else? I, I like Last Stand, I like Power Rush. And we'll do close calls. No, no, Mega Rush. Just in case. <laughs> Gotta love how fast that HP goes up. <laughs> I'm kind of worried about Lava Piranha. I feel like he's going to be really difficult. Oh, really? I think he will. <laughs> <laughs> nice to see you. I can arrange another battle with the Crystal Keen, if that is what you want. Sure. Do not underestimate your foe, no matter how easily you may have defeated them before. I mean, he was a joke earlier. Hey, Crystal Keen, 120 HP. That's what I'm talking about. I knew this from the last fight! Okay, I should just let him kill me, shouldn't I? No, we're not, we're not going down without a fight. I forgot his crown is spiky in pro mode. I needed spike shield! Hmm. I can still deal de decent damage with my hammer, just nowhere near as much. I want to know how much damage each of these crystal bed attacks do. Eight p a piece. 
Nice. Okay. Nope. No peril for me. <laughs> Wait. I have a fiendish idea. It's probably a really bad idea, but if I die, it's fine. This might bring me right into peril. My danger badges are probably useless, yeah. So if I don't action guard these, will this bring me down to 1 HP? Oh no, that's right. Plus 1 defense actually gives you plus 2 defense. Silly me. But I do have last stand now, and power rush will help me against this guy. If he wants to keep summoning these guys back, I'm I'm cool with it. <laughs> I love doing my nails while I watch Artie get pummeled. Well, <laughs> screw you too, Marty. <laughs> Not really. Oh my gosh. Well, I'm cool if if Crystal King wants to just keep summoning these guys over and over again. Spiny Surge makes short work of them. Here we go. <laughs> That's the power of Last Stand! And Water Block. And, like, a 100 damage dodge badges. <laughs> Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay, if we ser are we seriously going to beat the Crystal King without even really trying? That would be kind of hilarious. <laughs> yeah, no worries, Marty. I know it's all in good fun. Oh. Oh well. If only there was uh, some way that we could attack all of him at the same time. Are you having cake? <laughs> I'm not having cake. I ate all of my birthday cake. I finished the last piece uh, this afternoon. Oh yeah, I forgot he can do that. Same damage as Watts Electro. Wow, Bombet, you are really bad in this. How the mighty have fallen. Yeah, forget that. Why would I ever spend four FP to blow him up when an Electro Dash costs zero FP and does the exact same amount of damage? <laughs> I'm so glad I'm good at action guarding that. <laughs> that attack is so annoying if you can't action guard it. Keep saving my life, Sushi. <laughs> I think I've been underappreciating Sushi all of these years. She's really good. <laughs> oh my goodness. It is not my birthday today, Mobius. It was my birthday on the 15th, though. Oh yeah, and happy birthday to Silken Healer. We play Among Us together. He's great. Okay, we need an... Uh, I think we're going to need Spiny Surge. I'm running low on FP. I can't believe I'm saying this, but... Yikes! Alright, well, he just, he just died. Goodbye, Crystal Kane. I cannot believe I beat you when I made an extremely stupid mistake. <laughs> 29 star points! Oh boy! Once again, he is defeated, but not for good. No victory lasts forever. Take these star pieces and go in peace. Yes, sir. 
All right. Oh, there's a holographic peach up there. That's fun. All right, but it's time for the creme de la creme. <laughs> Bro's an old man. I'm a quarter of a century. Yeah, it's true. All right, well, for this fight, for Lava Piranha... You know what's the most exciting thing about winning? It's when you win. I love that feeling. It's very true. We definitely want ice power and fire shield. That That's a must. One of the, the few fights that they're actually good for. Um, I think multi-bounce as well. Yeah, I think multi-bounce will be good for early on. Uh, let's see... Yeah, Sushi's really good for this fight. Oh boy. Has Strider 7X played this before? I bet he has. I bet he has. Alright. Lava Prana is my favorite boss of, like, all time. I'm so excited. <laughs> well, are you ready to fight the Lava Prana again? Yes, I've been ready for my whole life! No holding back. I'm expecting a decisive victory from you. Of all time. It's one of them. One of my favorite fights of all time. Wait. I didn't tattle on the Lava Buds? Definitely top two or top three of all time. I think excluding final bosses, maybe. Ouch. The bosses don't seem to be any more powerful. I thought they were going to be more powerful. Ouch. Okay, yep. Squirt away the lava buds. Doggone it, it just barely doesn't kill. Ouch! <laughs> oh, wait. I don't have any snowman dolls. This is going to make his second phase a lot more difficult. Wow. I am really bad at action guarding these. No one breaks their leg like Gaston. <laughs> That would have been more appropriate when I was intentionally taking damage from Crystal Cane. Why am I so bad at action guarding that? Alright, rest of his first phase should be... I swear I'm good at this game. <laughs> Alright, there we go. I kept doing it too early. is so difficult! <laughs> Alright, at least I'm guarding his attacks now. <laughs> Come on, please. What is wrong with me? <laughs> Why am I so bad at this? <laughs> this isn't even the hard part of the fight. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get this. There we go, at last! I probably should save my FP for the second phase, where we actually need to put out some fires. Or I can eat a sweet shroom. <laughs> I knew you'd like that alert, Marty. <laughs> oh my gosh, we've got a big audience tonight. I'm just, I'm looking at the people in chat and wow, we have so many. Thank you all for coming out. This is a great honor. All right, belly flop him to death. <laughs> Oh, wait. Nope. It's not over, folks. It's only half over. <laughs> oh, now he's on fire. And he's panting like a dog. <laughs> Pretty much. Also, I haven't 
I haven't tattled on the petite piranhas yet, so I'm gonna let them come out. And I will probably regret it. No! Oh, but I crumple them. That's great. Mario, you shan't fight alone. Colorado to the rescue. Hiya! He's here too. <laughs> oh, 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 hot! Oh, it burns. Really? <laughs> so sorry, old chap, but that's all I can do at the moment. Good luck with all this. <laughs> all right, spit out the petite piranhas because I still need to tattle on them. <laughs> I forgot I didn't tattle on them because I lost a lava piranha a bunch too. All right, Goombario. <laughs> oh wait, I did tat. Wait, I did tattle on them, but how come then I had to tattle on? But I had to tattle on the lava buds. Okay, guess not. All right, it's time for Artie to fail big time at Tidal Wave. Actually, that went better than I was expecting. Wow, that went way better than I was expecting. <gasps> I can multi-bounce them away. Unless I suck! <laughs> you should come out to my streams more often. And I'm totally saying that not in just a way of <laughs> I want more viewers. Okay, I believe you. The whole action command thing is the major thing you don't like about this game. I actually love the action commands. I think they add a lot of flavor to the battle system. Like, if I ever made an RPG, I would totally add in stuff like that. Okay, I guess you have to hit him with two different ice attacks in order for him to uncrumple. Or for him to crumple in the first place. Alright, well, um... That's about how Tidal Wave normally goes. Bye, Lava Piranha. You're an amazing fight. I was expecting him to be a little more... Well, honestly, most of the difficulty from that fight came from me sucking hardcore at the action commands. Oh my gosh, those star points, though. We're one level away from capping our level. It would be great to be at max level for the Master's final phase. Well done. Even better than the first time. Take these star pieces. <laughs> okay, well. I guess we're going to see what Peach is all about. I think we're going to have to fight Bowser again. Which I'm excited for. Alright, if it's Bowser, we're going to want D-down jump. That's for sure. Definitely feeling fine. Oh man, we can't equip Zap Tap if that's the case. We also can't finish him off with the pebble anymore because I used up my pebble. Please forgive me. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. I want to see what Berserker is all about and how much it actually does buff your attack by. <laughs> Do it. Oh, Ma Artie has to talk in a weird voice for a whole minute. Oh, man. I forgot I added that as a Twitch alert. Um, okay. Just in time for fighting Bowser, I guess. Um, <laughs> what voice should I do? <laughs> oh, well, uh, I'll do it for you, Marty. I'll do an Owen Wilson. <laughs> Wait, that's that's not my Owen Wilson. I'll do an Owen Wilson voice for the next minute. <laughs> All right, so we're going to take on the final boss. Oh, I'm so glad to see that you're safe. But you're not ready for this fight until you finish the hours. I tried to beat Goomba King, but he crashes the game every time. <laughs> Come on, Peach. <laughs> Throw me a bone here. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, ever. So, for those of you who weren't here earlier in the stream, I've been. F I fought Goomba King like two or three times, and he crashed the game every time. <laughs> so. This is not going to be very easy. We're going to... Alright, we're going to need Mega Quay. <laughs> I, I don't think we can use Berserker Badge for this one. We're going to need Mega Quake <laughs> so we can hit everybody. And then, uh, what else should we equip, folks? How, how about something just like D-Down Jump? That, that's always a good idea. 
This is not really, this isn't really Owen Wilson's voice anymore. <laughs> Every time I start doing it, it always devolves into something else. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna try this one more time. Maybe if I don't level up at the end of it, I can actually beat it without crashing the game. Otherwise, this is gonna be really annoying. <laughs> Alright. Fifteenth time is the charm, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Take this, Goomu Kane. <laughs> Alright, I think a minute has passed. Thank you for reminding me that I added that as a channel points reward. <laughs> oh, Red Goomba is more powerful than Blue Goomba. Because he's the attack-based one. <laughs> You're on fire! <laughs> I guess Red Goomba's immune to fire attacks. Well, that was a big mistakey. I thought I action guarded that. I swear I action guarded that. I wonder if Blue Goomba's immune to ice attacks, all one of them. Oh man. Oh. Uh. Nah, forget it. I'm taking out Blue Goomba. Take that! Okay! <laughs> okay! I really hope that this <laughs> takes out... I really hope that this actually doesn't crash the emulator for the third time. That would be great. Ouch. That would have been really stupid if I had died to that. <laughs> How about a kiss? I have used Smooch way more in this playthrough than I, like, ever have before. It's a great way of boosting your HP, because you run out of it just so fast. <laughs> for luck. <laughs> yeah, it's a kiss for luck, of course. Oh, wait. Actually, no. D-down jump I don't think would have done anything. That's right, because Blue Goomba never actually boosted his defense. All right. Bye, Goomba Kane. You're forget of the Zelda show. That was an intentional reference. All right, come on, come on! Don't crash! Don't crash! Don't crash! Don't crash! Don't crash! Don't go! Why? It always crashes for the Goomba Kane and only the Goomba Kane. All right, that's Objection. exactly. That is so unfortunate. <laughs> you know what this means, folks? I'm literally going to have to get a separate emulator just to beat that fight on to take on the final Bowser fight. That's all there is to it. That's what I'm going to have to do. Alright, well, I'm not giving up just yet. I mean, I'm totally giving up on the Goomba King. Because, I mean, I can't do anything about that. I'm going to have to beat that off street, off camera and save that I beat it. And I'll pro Maybe I'll do like a, a recording session off stream of doing the, uh, the final Bowser fight. Because... It looks like we're literally about to finish all the post-game content. I mean, I can't get Chuck Quizmo to appear, but... Well, what you gonna do? Other than that, it's literally just the Master. And I, I'm gonna take him on. He's gonna be the toughest fight, I pretty much guarantee it. The famous Merlo. All right. We have 17 star pieces. I'm going to get Happy Heart. And I'm going to get HP Drain. Okay, so I have one. There's still seven. 
There's still 12 more star pieces out there. I assume that I'll get two from beating Goomba King and not crashing the game, and I'll get two from the final Bowser fight, maybe more. But then there's only a small handful from Chuck Quizmo, so... Did I miss some star pieces somewhere? I'm kind of confused about this. Let's see what Marie Lovely has to say about it. All right. Wah, twinkle light, twinkle bright. Tell me, mirror, magic mirror on the wall. Tell me where the star pieces all are. I see a star piece just beyond the bridge where you defeated the Goomba King is an open hill that cannot be climbed. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot about that one. Shazibi Shazubi! <laughs> now, I do not condone consulting witchcraft in real life. But in Paper Mario, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I can't find Chuck Quizmo anywhere. I've literally been everywhere and he hasn't appeared. It's a problem. Oh, I also have to see if that cake is made. I have to see if that cake was the final recipe as well. I actually don't really have to. If I don't make all the recipes, that's okay. I forget exactly where the hidden panel is. There it is. Forgot about that one. Oh, you can see the creases in the walls. It's great. Alright, so I guess my final plans is I'm going to take on the Master. And then I think I'm going to end the stream. I'm going to try to beat Goomba King legitimately off stream, and then I'll make a video of me fighting the final Bowser, and I think that's basically it. Thank you. Oh, and we can make a Jelly Ultra. I think I will do exactly that. Hey, Ouija. Yeah, I've made all the recipes now. Cool. Oh my god, wait, there are way more Chuck Quizmo quizzes than it said earlier. This is their 93 now? Oh, well, that's where all the star pieces are, apparently. Oh, wait, no, that's including the ones I fail. Oh, that's including the ones I failed, isn't it? Well, maybe not. No, that has to include the ones they fail, because that exceeds the number of star pieces there are in the game. You dare attempt to fight the master, you will die, apparently. And then the... It says I've collected all but one bit. Oh. Wait, that can't be right. There are two badges from Merlo with... Okay, that's just screwed up. <laughs> that's just screwed up. All right. Well, folks, we have a lot of busted items that we can use here, so that's exactly what we're going to do. I don't... No, I don't want to buy. You're, I, can't, I can't use any of this stuff you have. All right. Repel gel? Repel gel? Another repel gel. <laughs> What's this? Is that a repel gel? Why, yes, I would like it. Oh my gosh, well, there's more repel. Wow, there's just so much repel gel. It's really quite fantastic. We don't need jam and jelly. It's almost like this is actually going to be really easy because I grinded up repel gel off camera one time. Might want to save a couple for Super Bowser. You know what? You're right. You're right. Just in case, I should save some for Super Bowser. I don't know what he has in store, so that's a good idea. Plus, it, it wouldn't be fun if I literally just spammed repel gel for the entire... I'll save half of them. Half of them I will save for Bowser. Half of them I'll use for this. In the meantime... I definitely will take some hustle drinks, because Master gets more powerful the longer the fight goes on. Yep. 
There we go. <laughs> Maybe I should use repel gel. <laughs> Maybe oh, it's it's an option. Are you having cake? <laughs> no, unfortunately, I I stored it. <laughs> cake is not a very good item at this point. <laughs> oh, that would be the ultimate troll. I go up against. The no, I do not want to cook with my hustle drink. That would be the ultimate troll. I use the Repel Gel and the Master uses Star Beam to get rid of it. And then attacks in the same turn, because that's how the enemies work in this game. <laughs> Tra -la 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 -la. Here you are, the recipe's not too bad. Jelly Ultra. Th not too bad. That's it's only literally the best height health refilling FP uh, refilling item in the entire game. It's not too bad. Alright. I think we might have to tattle on him, maybe? I don't even know why I'm bothering going after the tattles, but I definitely want to be able to see his HP. Oh wait, badge setup. That's kind of important. Badge setup is a bit important. Alright. Definitely D-down jump. No Mega Quake. I think I'll equip Super Jump Charge. I think that'll actually help. Actually, instead of D-down jump, I'm going to go for Power Bounce. No P-up D-down. No siree. I'll keep feeling fine on, just in case. I have one extra FP. I will equip... Power Rush. <laughs> Double Dip also might be a helpful one for this fight, but nah. I can always Repel Gel and then... Quaff a Jelly Ultra. Alright, Master. I've come for the final battle. <laughs> ah, Mario, welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? I'm here to, just to try. Very well. I will fight you once more. This time I will hold nothing back at all. Do you believe you're ready? Well, I do, do have six repel gel. Only three of them with me, though. To battle! Qua! Behold my fury, Mario! Wait! He gets to attack first! That is far more attacks than yours. I'm sorry, you get one attack, not 12! <laughs> you get one attack, not 12! <laughs> this is the master! He's the strongest member of the dojo! No! Actually, he has less HP than I thought he would. Wow, we're gonna just repel Joe right off the bat, I guess. Yeah, Mario, survive this if you can. That was... What do you mean, Repel Gel only lasts for one turn? That is... Such... Word I can't use. Hmm, <laughs> you have a great hidden strength for one clothed like a plum. Well, this is just the practice round, folks. This is just the practice round. See if you could get through here, Sonic. Okay... Oh wait, he okay, he just pulls a sans. Okay, he uses his strongest attack first. Alright. Well, unfortunately we're still hosed. Should have gotten deep down jump. Oh my god. Look at his insane defense. <laughs> Alright. Oh wait. I don't have any life shrimp. It's not my fault you pulled out the 50-hit combo at the beginning. Alright, well, that, um, yeah, Repel Gel sucks for this fight. I'm not gonna use it. Guess what? I guess I have, s maybe, they I wonder if they just flat out nerfed Repel Gel in this. Maybe they just made it so it only lasts for literally, like, the one turn you use it on. Alright, well, I'm getting better items, then. Already has to talk in another, a weird voice for another minute! Oh, sweet. <laughs> what voice to do? I really should have just a list of voices that I can do. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, I just... My repel gel's gone. Great. Hmm. 
Weird voice, weird voice, weird voice. Why is it so difficult to think of a weird voice on the spot? Yeah, well, I guess I'll just talk like this. Oh, boy. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to get some big health and fitting items. The honey, uh, honey Ultra, that sounds pretty good. Deluxe Feast, always delicious. Another Deluxe Feast, it sounds pretty good. And uh, Maple Ultra, we need all the health we can get. Uh oh. <laughs> this is not gonna be good. Oh, oh. Gotta reset our badges as well, folks. Let's see. No super jump charge. No power mount. We're doing D down jump. No double dip. That's not happening. I think that extra defense might be used. No, no. You know what? We're doing flower saver. Yeah, that's that looks pretty good. All right, there we go. Looks like we'll be using Watt for the entire time, folks. The, we need all the defense piercing things we can get. D-down jump and electro dash every turn. Unless we use out of sight. Actually, Flower Saver's probably a waste. I don't care. We're going to try it again. We're going to try it again. <laughs> well, well, Marty, if the microphone peaked, you're the one who's making me talk like this. You're the one who's making me talk in a weird voice. Twice. Great, we only took 20 damage that time! Hooray! Or is it just... Oh no, that didn't deal less damage. Just because I have a lowered attack power thanks to P down D up. That's why. I'm always afraid he's going to pull out another punch in the middle of his attack. I need to make sure I, can't, I don't let my health fall too far. Uh-oh. <laughs> Proxima has 12,000 arty points. He could make me talk in a weird voice for 12 whole minutes. I will cut people off eventually if they abuse it, but in the meantime, I don't think... Alright. Honey Ultra time. <laughs> Hiya, Mario! Survive this if you can! Ouch. Ow! Oh my gosh. Yep. This guy's just as tough as I remember. Well, actually, a lot tougher than I remember. Uh, you have great strength. Alright. I think now is where we have to start busting out out of sight, like, every single turn. We could chill him out, but that only lowers his attack power by two. It's not that great. I'd rather get kisses. hey -ya! Survive this if you can. Oh my gosh. I need, I need to be able to master that action command. If I can't, I am dead. He's more than halfway down, though, so that's interesting. Now it is time I stop being so... You, you did an, like an 80-hit combo on me at the beginning. You have a strange definition of mercy. Yes, Maple Ultra. This is exactly what I want. Okay, I can survive another attack. I forgot. More powerful the more the fight goes on. Uh-oh. This is not good. 
Oh, that didn't deal much damage at all, actually. Get out. You almost made me fail the action plan there! Alright, um... I'm not taking any chances. I, it would not put me past if the Master can deal 40 damage in one turn. Dog on it. I could have survived that. What? Oh, come! Are you serious? <laughs> uh, that's annoying. I wasted my health fulfilling items. I'm not wasting my health fulfilling items. I'm getting those back. Those were two ultra shrooms. Yes, I'm re Yes, I'm. <laughs> I'm safe scumming. So sue me. <laughs> All right, this is not going to work. We cannot do this without at least one life shroom. And I'm I'm too lazy to even make my own. That will take too long. Oh my gosh, and we didn't we haven't done the chapter 8 challenge either. Dog on it. Okay. Oh, and I think Shaggy's streaming Mario Kart too. That's a shame. Well, you know what? Sorry, Shaggy. Alright, Boo Shop sells life shrooms. We're going to beat Master tonight. The Chapter 8 challenge is actually going to be legitimately tough, too. Doug Doug is streaming for the first time in months. Who the heck is Doug Doug? You need to get to work, Nintendo Addict? Well, thank you for joining in. I hope you had a good time and good luck at work today. I hope it doesn't go as long as my work did. Okay. We don't need all of these. Oh yeah, hustle. I forgot. The hustle drink exists. That actually would be really nice. I'm still carrying too much. I, I'm going to get two life streams just in case. Because I don't trust myself. It's a good thing I have a huge stockpile of cash. <laughs> being, being a celebrity is hard. With like all the flashing lights, the long walks, and all the paper cuts to get Kevin in my huge stacks of money. <laughs> Alright, well. I can't stream for s too much longer. But we are going to beat the Master. And then I... Maybe we'll do the Chapter 8 challenge and the rest... Uh, if, I'm not sure if I'll do a separate stream just for those. I feel like I should just do a recording a video for it. Because I, I can't really stream for the rest of this week. Or, I mean, I, I can stream Saturday, but... I don't want to devote an entire Saturday stream just to finishing up Paper Mario Pro Mode when there is definitely not enough content for that. All right. All right, master time. We're gonna beat this time. We're gonna beat him. I am confident. I miss Phineas and Verb too. Great show, but I'm glad that they didn't milk it dry. I'm glad that it ended on a high note. I feel like not enough stuff does that. I feel like I, you, often you you can get shows like Arthur where it's like, yeah, Arthur should have ended years ago. Well, that could have gone a lot better. Hustle Drink will be useful for later on in the fight. Thank you, D-Down Jump, for existing. D-Down Jump makes fiends a lot more manageable in Pro Mode. Where everything has more defense, basically.
And there's a harder version of this hack, by the way, Paper Mario Master Quest. I am not going to play that one. At least not on stream. Alright, then now we need to chug a Honey Ultra just for safety. We have all these amazing health fulfilling items, we might as well use them. Good thing I used it, because that would have just killed me. No, that's not what I wanted to do! Uh oh. I forgot. I was defaulting to out of sight. That was really stupid. That was colossally stupid, as a matter of fact. Are we raiding after this? Um, if Shaggy's still streaming, which I guarantee he will be, then yes. We have an amazing turnout for it. Also, if Shaggy's still streaming Mario Kart, I might end up joining him. <laughs> Because I often do play Mario Kart with him on his streams, and it's always a lot of fun. Alright. We do have life shrooms, so we will be safe. Now it's time I stop being so merciful. Oh. That's it? Okay. It's hustle time, Woody! I love how they have a separate animation for that, even though it wasn't in the original game. Okay, so it looks like only the Master's generic punch attack gets stronger as the fight goes on. Wait, but I have the Hustle Drink! What a hacker! What a hacker! He, he literally... I used the Hustle Drink, I should have been able to attack twice in a row. I'll just use the Life Shroom. Oh no, if he kills me in the middle of this, we'll use my Life Shroom and then continue his attack. It better not. Come on, I've, I've beaten him... F well, I'm not going to say fair and square, but... Um, why is he just standing there like that? I don't like this. Is he gonna come back to life? No, okay. Oh, wow, the experience points. I'm sorry, star points. Hmm, noble Mario, you have bested me, the master, the talk, the strongest of fighters. Since you have beaten me at my full strength, I give you this with respect. You get the diploma! It's useless! Okay, well, I think we're going to end the stream there. Thank you all for tu tu uh, tuning in. We will be raiding Shaggy now. I, at least, I think he's streaming. I think I got the alert that he was streaming, so we're going to try that. Um, I still have to fig figure out if I'm going to finish the rest of this on another stream. I think I'm going to be recording it off stream, just because I have to do the Goomba King fight off stream anyways. I'll, I'll record a video of the Chapter 8 challenge as well as, like, the final star pieces and then the ba final Bowser fight. And I think that I'll just make a separate video for that. And then we can stream something new next week and something new this Saturday. So that's going to be fun. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> you should. I, <laughs> don't be sarcastic. I, I, I will do that. Have a great day and God bless everybody.